And for the last con, and certainly the most severe, wildfires can be a real threat to Rio Doso, New Mexico, especially during the summer months. Rio Doso, New Mexico is a small mountain town nestled in the lower portion of the Sacramento Mountains. The town has a rich history and culture that makes it an ideal place to live or visit. Rio Doso offers some amazing activities, views, and attractions for those looking to spend time outdoors or taking the sights indoors. But just like any other city, it has its downsides. This is Ryan Ariza with Atmos Real Estate Group, and here are the pros and cons of Rio Doso New Mexico. As you know, we are realtors. We do sell real estate in Rio Doso, and from what I've seen, it's quickly becoming a top spot for vacation homes and rental properties, especially with people from Texas. Rio Doso, New Mexico is an ideal destination for outdoor enthusiasts. From skiing and snowboarding in the winter to fishing and hiking in the summer, there are plenty of activities to keep visitors busy year round. There are also several golf courses and horseback riding stables available for those who want to take advantage of the great outdoors. Rio Doso, New Mexico is a hiker's paradise with plenty of trails to explore from beginner level hiking to more advanced treks. The area offers something for everyone. One of the most popular trails in Rio Doso is the Sierra Blanca Trail, which leads up the Sierra Blanca Peak and provides stunning views of the surrounding forests and mountains. Another fun fact I think is really cool when you're on the top of Sierra Blanca, whether it's hiking or skiing, you can see all the way to White Sands National Park. Rio Doso, New Mexico has many tourist attractions, which makes it a great destination for vacationers. The Inn of the Mountain Gods Resort offers guests an abundance of activities and amenities that can be enjoyed, from golfing on a championship level golf course to lounging beside the pool, or you can test your luck at the casino located inside the resort. Guests also have access to some of the best restaurants and bars in town. Rio Doso Downs Racetrack and Casino is also a popular site as visitors can enjoy the thrill of live horse races and the chance to gamble in their casino. Another must-see attraction is the Hubbard Museum of the American West, where they house one of the largest collections of firearms and artifacts from the 19th century. Rio Doso is an ideal destination for nature lovers. The area is known for its diverse population of elk, deer, bear, and other native species. This abundant wildlife provides visitors with the opportunity to observe and photograph these creatures in their natural habitats. Bird watching is also popular among tourists as several species can be found in the area, including cardinals, cactus wrens, and the great blue herons. Many of these birds can be seen at Grindstone Lake or along nearby hiking trails. Rio Doso is also home to a wide variety of reptiles, such as rattlesnakes and lizards, which can often be spotted while out exploring. Another thing I love about Rio Doso is the culture. The rich cultural history of Rio Doso is rooted in its strong ties to the Mescalero Apache tribe. This Native American tribe has been part of this area long before it was settled by Europeans, and they still maintain close ties with the region today. Visitors to Rio Doso can experience the unique culture of the Apache through various events such as traditional dances and powwows, or even by visiting the nearby Mescalero Cultural Center. There are also plenty of opportunities for travelers to learn about the art, customs, and traditions of this vibrant culture through guided tours and lectures. Rio Doso's vibrant downtown offers plenty of amenities and activities to keep visitors entertained all day long. Located in the heart of Rio Doso, this bustling area is home to many shops, restaurants, and galleries that features artwork from local artists with a diverse selection of restaurants, shopping opportunities, and recreational activities, downtown Rio Doso is sure to provide an unforgettable experience for everyone. All right, now let's get into some of the cons for Rio Doso. Rio Doso, New Mexico can get quite cold in the winter months, obviously, due to its high altitude, temperatures often reach below freezing, and snow is not uncommon. Especially during January and February, residents should be prepared for these cold temperatures by making sure they have a warm coat and gloves, as well as other necessary winter gear, such as a shovel or ice scraper. Another con for Rio Doso is typically when people visit, they expect to see a small town with little to no people, but crowds in Rio Doso is a real thing, and it can be an issue during the summer months. This is especially true on weekends when many people take advantage of outdoor activities such as skiing, fishing, and visiting downtown. Also, popular tourist attractions such as the Rio Doso Downs Racetrack and Casino are often filled with visitors. Residents should take care to plan ahead to avoid the busiest times of the year in order to have an enjoyable, peaceful experience in Rio Doso. Public transportation is also very limited in Rio Doso, and while the town does have a bus system, it's limited in its scope and it only serves certain areas of the community. Another con for Rio Doso is that in some parts, poor internet and cell phone coverage can be an issue. While it's really not a major problem in most places, it can be especially troublesome if you're trying to stay connected with family or friends while on vacation. For example, spotty coverage may prevent video calls or make streaming quite difficult. 
And for the last con, and certainly the most severe, wildfires can be a real threat to Rio Dosa, New Mexico, especially during the summer months. Unfortunately, due to the area's dry and arid climate, wildfires are not uncommon and have caused destruction in both urban and rural parts of town. Residents should stay aware of their surroundings and take necessary precautions such as avoiding open flames, disposing of your cigarettes, and keeping flammable materials away from buildings. Additionally, it is wise to keep an eye on local weather forecasts for any warnings or alerts related to fire activity. Another fun fact for Riodoso, many of you know Smokey the Bear's message, only you can prevent wildfires, but fewer people may know that Smokey the Bear was actually a real American black bear rescued in the spring of 1950 from a raging wildfire just outside of Riodoso, New Mexico. I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. Definitely subscribe to our channel if you want to see some more videos of our amazing state. I hope you guys have a great day, and I'll see you next time.